What is good, John? Welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy, J.I., and I'm back at it again with a special guest this time. What's good, y'all? Versatile Speed in the mix. Yes, yeah, sir. Make sure you get my boy to 400 subscribers right now. What you at, like 350 something right now? Uh, 338. 338? Get my boy to 400 subscribers, man. You dig what I'm saying? But anyway, as you guys see by the title and the thumbnail, today we are on a rescue mission, all right? Got a little Mustang Mach E going by. Anyway, we are on a rescue mission, all right? We want to tell the people what we're going to go save, brother. Attempt to save, goddamn. Gotta go save the Ninja 300, y'all. The Ninja? What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Go save the Ninja 300, y'all. Bro, uh, I'm out, man. That nigga's tripping. Nah, Ninja? Uh, what the f? I don't like what you have the Ninja. It's definitely a Yamaha R3. Oh, my bad. Wrong at least you got the three parts. <laughs> knew it was 300. At least you got the three parts. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, right now we are on our way to go pick up that bike. I know I have not talked about that bike on the channel just because it just doesn't get any views. You know what I'm saying? And also I don't drive it. So right now we're gonna go pick it up, try to jump start it, get it to run, and then drop it off at the shop. Let them go ahead and fix all the shit that I don't want to do. And then uh, yeah, man, it should be sold within. Probably like two weeks to be honest if the buyer ain't on bullshit. So we'll go ahead and roll that intro and get straight into this video, man. Let's get it. Alright y'all, so just got to the bike, I'm gonna go ahead and take this cover off, try to get the bike to turn over, and then go from there. What you think? Think we got some juice in here? <laughs> this nigga's stupid. <laughs> One hour later. Alright y'all, got the battery connected. Try to see if we can jump it. Damn jump box from the J. Now this motherfucker. put the key in, see if we got some juice. We might have some juice. I know I ain't got no damn juice. See, some lights put on in these. It didn't work last time, brother. It didn't so, and it came straight off the charger last time. Did you put the battery in the freezer? You know that recharge? No, I did not. I took it to AutoZone. Let them do it. Oh, nigga. Yeah, we go. Yeah, That's we go. There you go. How long has it been? Oh, it's time, man. About like a year, to be honest with you. That thing started right up. Alright y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and put the battery hold down back on it, put the seat back on, and then we gotta hit the road. It's 424, we gotta hit that by 4.30. Shit. No problem, bro. 
So y'all, this is the struggle we're going through right now. As you can see, the light's flickering. And normally that's due because, you know, the camera's trying to pick up the light. But no, not in this case. It's actually because the bike's dying. But he's trying to keep it running, man. And we're trying to make it to the shop. We It's already, what time is it? 4.44, man. Hopefully the guy's still there waiting for him. Or at least we can leave the bike there. And he can just drop off the key whenever because, man, we just trying to make it there, man. So, y'all, by the grace of God, pulling up to the shop, man. I know my boy happy because that thing wanted to cut off so many times. Better job. Ooh. Come on, man. You should stop that dog. They got some craters over here, man. That boy just in time. Look, look, don't even want to start no more. <laughs> they don't even want to cut on no more, huh? Yeah, no. You can park it right there. All right. As y'all can see, got the bike here. Just dropped it off right now to get it fixed. My boys are going to take care of me. And yeah, man, I will update y'all as the process goes. But it's here. That's all that matters. <laughs> yes, sir. LL Motorcycle. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no paid promotion or none of that shit. They just got my bike. This is from my personal records. If my shit get fucked up, I'm on that ass. You feel me? No way is it. I'm going. <laughs> All right, y'all, you did what I'm saying. So without further ado, huge shout out to my boy, Les. Make sure you guys go tap it with him on Instagram, for real, for Instagram, YouTube, shit, the whole nine. You know what I mean? speed, gotcha. Everything, you know, TikTok, the whole mook. I'm telling y'all, we taking over TikTok. It's, it, I'm, I'm going crazy. You feel me? Video every day for y'all, no cap. But with all that being said, man, that's gonna be it for this video. Um, I'm super stoked that I finally was able to drop off the freaking bike. Hopefully they can fix everything in a timely fashion. He told me it'd probably take like a week for the brake line to come in, which, you know what I'm saying, is coming from the dealer, so I can understand it, you know what I'm saying? But without further ado, y'all, that's gonna be it for this video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you smash that subscribe button. Make sure you turn on those post notifications. Drop a comment in the comment section down below. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.